we finally found something Rajini Gant can't do. Get his movie released in Karnataka. But getting banned is nothing new for South Indian films. So let's take a look at some films that caught a controversy and won big. First of all, we have Vishirubam. This Kamalasan starer was a hotbed for controversy with Hindu groups protesting the use of Sanskrit in the movie's title and various Muslim groups stating the film hurts Muslim sentiments. Following last scale protests, the film was banned in the state of Tamil Nadu and in countries like Malaysia, Sri Lanka and Singapore. Despite the setbacks, the film was both a critical and commercial success and grossed over 250 crores. Next we have Arjun Reddy. This film became the centre of a huge protest after a poster of the film showing the two leads kissing was released and with many politicians calling for a ban on the film stating the film could corrupt you. However, following its release, the film became a blockbuster and rose over 500 crores at the box office. Next up, we have Kala. The upcoming Rajinikanth film is banned in Karnataka following protests from various political organizations over Rajinikanth's influence on the Kaveri water issue. And with the actors' recent statements on the Totokodi massacre, several activist groups in Norway and Switzerland had the movie banned in both European countries. However, Kala has already sold its satellite rights for a massive 70 crores and box office prediction set the film to have a 20 crore opening. Next, Iruva, Maniratnam's masterpiece, is based on the rise of politician MGR and M. Karnanadi. Several political groups protested and called for a ban on the film. They believed it portrayed the leaders in a bad light. After its release, they held demonstrations to stop theatres from playing the film, with some even sending death threats to the director. However, Iruva was a success and went on to win two national awards and is considered one of the greatest Indian films ever made. Lastly, we have Bus Stop. The 2012 comedy was flagged by certain student organisations stating the sexual themes of the jokes. Protests were held in Hyderabad where posters of the film were burned and movie theatres attacked. Despite these issues, the film became a huge hit at the box office and is one of the highest grossing films of 2012. So these are our picks for the movies that were controversial but went on to be successful. If you think we missed anything, do tell us in the comment section below and stay tuned to the AC Martini.